receiving word that longtime televangelist Ernest Angley has passed away at the age of 99 years old. I just find that age uh, to be just very significant. You know, this was the same age that Billy Graham had passed away, also at the age of 99. Now, the news came out uh, from his team that Ernest had passed away on Friday. Details of his death have not yet been released as far as what the cause of this may have been. But you want to talk about a man who, I mean, for decades, he served as the lead pastor of the Grace Cathedral Church just outside of the Cleveland, Ohio area. But a man who didn't start off with such a ministry like that, I mean, really growing up in the South, I mean, he really grew his ministry, working his way up, I mean, from doing tent revivals, even to the point where, you know, his early beginnings of his church was nothing more than just a tent set up outside in the parking lot. Well, that tent quickly grew into what then became a million-dollar facility later on and then sparked his ministry from there. He was on TV for many decades as well, just witnessing Christ to the entire world. Now, of course, this did not come without some controversy as well. There was some harassment claims made against the pastor. Uh, This was back in 2018. He dismissed those. There was a settlement that was apparently reached that was not disclosed as to what that was. That was settled in February of 2020. But also, uh, back in the 1950s in Germany, uh, reported arrests there that he was uh, trying to practice medicine without a proper license. That was later settled as well. So, um, you know, with a lot of these big-time evangelists, we're going to have these controversies. And some of them, very well, you know, could be true. Uh, We don't know this for sure. You know, only God truly knows, and he's going to judge and examine everybody. He knows the hearts of all men. Uh, But one thing we do know that is for sure is that many lives Uh, were in fact um, reached and many people were led to Christ uh, by here, uh, Pastor Ernest Angley and um, his family and everybody is asking you for their prayers at this time. Uh, Other ministers have chimed in from across the world just uh, touting uh, what a wonderful man of God he truly was, all the lives that he impacted and that now uh, he is uh, with his Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ in heaven, no longer suffering, saying that he has run his race and now he is reaping his rewards uh, in heaven. And guys, that leads uh, me to the ministry we have here. We are trying to get as many people to Jesus as we possibly can. And I'm gonna, I'll am gonna i put more information on Ernest for you uh, down below here. But I don't want to leave every video without giving people an opportunity to receive Christ. You know, you truly don't know when your last day could be. And so this is for you right now. If you've never received Christ, you start first by acknowledging that you're a sinner. We all are. But God sent his son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for the sins of all the world. He died and rose again for you and me. Now, what we need to do is repent of that sin. People say, what does repent mean? Repent means to turn from your sin, not just to say you're sorry, but to actually turn from a lifestyle, a habit, whatever it is in your life that's counter to what the word of God says. You ask Jesus to forgive you, he will wipe that sin away. The Bible says he won't even remember it anymore. And then you invite Jesus into your life to be your Lord and Savior. When you do that, you become born again, a child of God. You will have eternal life. And trust me when I tell you, there is no greater decision you will ever make than the one you make to give your life to Christ. And I pray that you make that decision today. I'll have some more information for you guys on this here down below. I also have the links to our ministry. You guys can help to donate to that if God lays it on your heart to do so. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I'll talk with you soon.